Hey guys, welcome back to Caveman Mining. I hope everyone is well and having a great day. On today's video, we are going to be doing a head-to-head -head testing Throw with him oh. on the miner for G Miner 2.71 and NB Miners 39.7. And essentially this testing is going to prove which of these two miners right now is king. I've been hearing a lot of good things about the G Miner with their uh, LHR auto tune mode. Uh, and we did previously test the NB Miner 39.6, which had really great results in terms of hash rate and wattage. So in this test, there's gonna be two factors that we weigh. The first factor is going to be hash rate, which card gets the higher hash rate. And the second variable is going to be power consumption. So we want to see which card or which, which miner rather pulls less wattage, which is more efficient with less jumps uh, and more stability at the wall here. So we will have our trusty wall meter going and we'll have the GoPro up to capture that live as we do the results at the miner. So without further ado, we will jump into the laptop and we will get started with the mining tests. Okay guys, so now we are into the laptop and the first thing we're gonna do is get into our mining computer here, our little test bench. And uh, I just want to compare the release notes quickly on the two miners as we're putting them head to head. So the first one we are looking at is the G Miner 2.71. And um, really the highlighting features of this miner is the improved light hash rate performance. Uh, they have added the uh, light hash rate mode zero uh, and energy mode minus one. So maximal uh, performance mode default. Um, and then they have this light hash rate auto tune, which I've heard pretty good things about. And this is what I would like to pit against the NB miner using this uh, auto tune mode. So if we tab over to the release notes for NB miner, um, essentially uh, the feature uh, change from 3 point, uh, 39.6 to 39.7 is the new GA104 uh, support. So officially supporting the 3060, <clears throat> um, they are doing the uh, light hash rate, uh, rate by default on the 3060 V1, uh, which was disabled uh, by default on Windows on uh, driver version 470.05. They've fixed a few things uh, with the uh, failures to det detect LHR in certain situations. Um, they've supposedly refined the power consumption on the uh, NVIDIA cards. So I've got both miners downloaded and pretty much locked and loaded and ready to go. Uh, I actually have one running at the moment, uh, which is the G miner. So we're going to take a look at the miner here. And as you guys can see, we have pulled three shares. I've just been running it just for a few minutes. Uh, hash rate of 35.46 mega hash at 110 watts in the software. Pulling an efficiency of 322.38 uh, kilowatt um, uh, efficiency. And if we pay attention and look over at the bottom right hand corner of our screen at the wall meter, we have some pretty steady wattage going on. Uh, at uh, bouncing between 145 watts to about 150 and not really peaking over 150. I think we got 150.9 was the highest that I saw. So extremely, extremely steady, right? And you can see that the LHR auto tune is putting us at 73% automatically. Um, and if we go ahead and look at our uh, clocks here, we have the memory at 1323. We have our power level set to 65 and our fan at 81%. Uh, staying at a pretty modest 
54 and 53 degrees Celsius on the uh, memory temperature. So pretty good. I have to say pretty good. This is right in line with, I think some of our tests with the NB minor 39.6. And I think actually we're pulling a little tiny bit hash rate higher than the 39.6 uh, and definitely definitely at the wall I'm going to see that this G minor is much more efficient and uh, pulling the hash rate of 35.50 so very steady on the hash rate very steady on the power consumption so needless to say I am quite impressed G minor you guys have uh, stepped up to the plate in terms of uh, you know going for the running in terms of the top dog for the miners so very cool i'm going to stop this miner here and uh, we're going to begin our test we're going to leave the same overclocks and uh, settings in the msi afterburner so we are not um you know really changing any variables in terms of what we're doing here so uh, let's go ahead and start ethereum on nb minor 39 0.7 and you can see the LHR mode is there. Uh, this may just take a few moments to, to spool up. So we'll watch the miner pretty intently here. Um, just to recap, you know, this, this whole running for the, who's going to become the top dog for the light hash rate uh, unlock for Ethereum. You know, we've had this not war, I'm going to say, but this friendly competition between Lull Miner, uh, G Miner, uh, NB Miner. Um, those have been kind of the top miners that have been doing this um, working. The developers have been working on, you know, cracking these light hash rate cards open for quite some time. So it's exciting stuff. It's a, again, another step in the right direction. So we will see what the results produce here uh, and you know, out of these two miners, for the sake of this video, I wanted to compare for you guys and see which one is better. And look at that right away. It's almost like we're, it's like, it's like punch for punch, right? 35.55 on the hash rate. It's almost identical to the G miner. And in the software, I think just a tiny bit better on the power at 109. So... Again, we're gonna pay attention to all of the factors. So we need to now pay attention to the bottom right-hand corner of the screen at the wall meter. And for wattage, we are pulling 149, 148, 150 watts. We haven't really broken the 150 watt mark there. I'm waiting to see if we do. But with G minor, we were getting down to 145 at the wall. So I haven't quite seen that uh, result yet here on my wall meter. I did see 152, 156, 146 uh, rather. So very, very, very close in terms of efficiency. Uh, take a look at that, 35.59 on the hash rate and the efficiency is almost identical 323.6 so maybe just a tiny teeny tiny bit more efficient on the uh, efficiency for nb minor but at the wall right it's it's the numbers don't lie i have a feeling that g minor is in my opinion in my case at this moment now we haven't let these tests run for quite a long time but so far i think g minor is taking the cake on efficiency especially at the wall um but this race is so so close this is like a one-two punch it's like uh, a chess match between the two you know two great chess players um very very similar results um and I think it's to each his own. Maybe, maybe uh, you know, every card is different, but I am pretty impressed with both results. I am impressed with both hash rates. I am impressed with both uh, wattage pulls at the wall and power consumption and efficiency. So 
This is going to sound uh, a little cliche, guys, but I'm going to call this a tie. <laughs> now, don't boo me. Don't boo me. But I really can't tell that much of a difference between these two miners. I think we're right at the door of, you know, that unlock at 73, 74% uh, unlock from the whole full uh, hash rate. You know, maybe NB minor squeezes a little more hash rate, but maybe G minor is a little bit more, you know, conservative on the, the hash rate. I would say that's the, the pluses for each. Um, I wouldn't really say there's any cons to running either of them at this point. But yeah, this was a cool test. This was an interesting test. Um, now you can see the wall is getting a little warm. Uh, 166 watts at the wall and uh, hanging up there. So yeah, I'm giving the hash rate win to NB minor, but I'm giving the efficiency win for G minor. So you guys decide for yourself which minor is better for your setup, for your cards. Um, yeah, and this is in Windows, so I'm curious if the results may vary within HiveOS, those of you who are running HiveOS and Linux. But uh, yeah, guys, if you like this comparison video, let me know. This is the first one I've done. Uh, I, I thought it was kind of cool to put these miners head to head against each other to see what we get. But uh, if you like what you saw, please give a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Uh, that keeps us uh, flowing and going here. And uh, with all that said, guys, we will see you on the next video. Take care.